give them prayer hands Say what's up America Half of you should know me right On the half a replica Alright, what is going on guys? It is Fez, back with another episode of From Nothing... I always forget the name of this series. Fuck. What is going on guys? It is Fez, and welcome back to another episode of Building a Setup from Nothing. So, I've made some really good progress, and I'm, I'm really excited for you guys to see this. So, first off... Well, I, my room's a little messy right now because I got boxes and stuff anywhere. That's my super, super old PC, which is a pile of garbage, but check this out. I'm sure you guys know what this is from last episode. This is my remote, but I'm just going to show you what I have so far. I ended up picking up my L desk, and it looks, it just looks phenomenal, but the only problem that I have with this desk, okay, I'm gonna go over here. So the only problem is that it, it looks great. It looks great. It is, I don't have much complaints, but getting it in my room was such a pain in the ass. It was unbelievable. I had to like take so many things apart. I, I honestly didn't think it was gonna fit in here, but these things are a lot bigger than you anticipate. Like, it doesn't look that big in the video, but it takes up a good amount of my room. Like, this is my walking area. And that's my dresser. I was thinking about getting rid of these dressers. I, I said I was going to get rid of them before, but... Turns out that it's really hard to move stuff. So I just threw my bed over here. I put my setup there. And it looked really nice. And moving on to the LED portion of that, I'm sure you guys have all been waiting for. Uh, the receiver is over there on that bear, and there we go. It looks so nice. I have it on pink right now, but I'm just going to show you guys. It's wrapped around all of the outside, and it, yeah, it's just, the way this works, actually, I'm going to get out, I'm going to get out something to, uh, for example, because I was actually really confused on figuring out how, like, this thing worked. But if I can get one of the strips out of here. So, look. there. This wraps around your entire desk. And 9 times out of 10, you're not going to use all of it. So there are these little strips right here. That have a scissors on it. And you actually cut those. And I was, I was pretty, pretty skeptical about doing that. Because I didn't think it would work properly. But as you can see, I just cut it right there, and everything works beautifully. I know I was a little, I was a little scared to do it at first, but it it turned out really good, and it makes my setup look like ten times better, guys. But wait, where did I put my remote? Where did I put that dang remote? Okay, I found my remote. But actually, like I said in my last episode, I wasn't gonna make an episode two until I got some more stuff for my setup so I could like show it off and then get one step further in my setup and guess what we got we got an Amazon package in the mail so you know what we gonna do we're gonna clear this shit off the bed real quick and uh, yeah I blacked out everything once again you guys know you guys know how it goes and we're gonna find another knife let's use a different one this time I like this one nice and heavy Wah! all right so uh yeah i'm not sure what's actually important to cross out like besides obviously the address and whatnot i can't open this with my left hand but i don't know if people can like track the tracking number and stuff like that but to be honest who cares it's it's whatever but I'm probably going to end up slicing my thigh open. Dude, this is so hard to do. Okay, we got that. And you guys probably don't even know what this is. Hold on, i got to put my foot up here. But, so in the, in the thumbnail, in the title, I'm probably just going to say something about my desk. Because, let's be honest, that's what most people care about the most. But I'm just going to let it be a surprise real quick because you guys probably don't know what, what's even in this box. So let's see. We have one package. 
And for the most part, I, I usually order uh, two items in a single package. So they all ship together. And I usually do stuff two at a time. So uh, you guys can probably see what that is. I'm actually pretty excited about that. But oh, let's just show that right there. Probably put it with the rest of my boxes real quick. Alright, so what do we got here? I'm actually really loving Red Dragon's products. Because as you guys know, my mechanical keyboard is a Red Dragon. Fully mechanical, it is beautiful. But if you want to hear me fanboy over that, then go to my last video. But yeah, we're moving on. We have the Red Dragon Centra Forest? I don't know. You guys can try and pronounce that, but it's got an 18 month warranty, so that's always great. And it kind of goes with the theme of my setup. You know, it's, it's kind of all red. Actually, let me turn on my PC quick. There we go. Well, you guys saw it for a brief second, but anyways, moving on. We gotta try and open this. I'm not actually sure what's all included. I don't know if there's like more than just a mouse in here. I don't think it came with a mouse pad. But no, it did not. But, oh yes, we have the braided cord. I've been wanting that. Yes, dude. The braided cord. If you guys are looking at mice or, or keyboards, you have to look for these cords because... I mean, this one isn't a braided cord, but this one has been known to last. So, you guys have to make sure you're looking at the cords. And braided cords, since this is going to be used a lot more and moved a lot more than the keyboard was, um, just make sure it has a good cord. Because if it, it gets all bent, then the wires are going to get messed up and it's not going to work. So, uh, just looking for stuff like that when you're trying to buy like mice and other accessories like that. Um, I just, I just think it's fairly important if you want your stuff to be like good quality and actually last a long time. Now, if I can get this stupid cord through. Alright. Oh, I really like that. It has like a really grippy texture right here. Sounds good. It feels good. I've, I've never personally had buttons on the side like this, and I'm not exactly sure what they do. But I think I'm going to play around with that, have a little fun, and see like what they're all about. I know this is the DPI button or something like that. I've never had a mouse with a DPI button to like change speeds and whatnot. But this has a really nice design on it. I really like the feel of it. And obviously, if you guys come look at my mouse right now... This is, this is a fairly small mouse, so I'm used to just having a pretty small mouse in my hand, but this, this fits my entire hand and it's very comfortable. I like that a lot. Alright, so let's move on to the next package. So, by the way, that mouse will be in the description. I think it was in total $20. I think it was $13 normal price plus... I think it was around seven dollars to be in handling or something like that so we're gonna open these i'm just gonna spoil it right now i wanted to get some quality speakers because i'm not gonna be i'm not gonna be playing with a tv forever that has like built-in speakers so i know that i would eventually need speakers and i don't want to have headphones in like all the time because after a while it always like hurts my ears but see yeah, how this opens here god i always have trouble opening these boxes okay i think we got it there we go there's always so many like flaps that you have to open. i don't even know oh it opens this way okay so we got we got a few things in here I don't, these aren't the biggest speakers, but these were, I think in total $30, 
Yeah, I think with shipping and handling these estimated out to be like $30 I ended up getting charged. So let's just grab these quick. Get these out of here. There we are. There's a little manual. The serial number or whatever. Yeah, just a little setup thing. So we don't need that, we don't need that. And yeah, um I I haven't tested these out, I haven't heard anything about these, but I think they should be pretty good and they should last. So I'm gonna set everything up again quick and uh I'll be back. I'm not sure if my mouse is back backlit, I guess we'll find out, but yeah, it's, it's a pretty nice day outside, actually. Check it out. Some chicks walking her dog. Actually, here, check this out. This is like my favorite part. I should, probably should have showed this earlier, but fade three. It just goes through all the colors. I just, it's pretty cool. You can turn on the brightness. You, you guys probably can't even see it, but just know that you can adjust the brightness. And uh, actually, right here, I am putting in my two weeks notice for McDonald's. I'm officially quitting McDonald's, so that's pretty awesome. Obviously, it's not because of YouTube, because I, oh, I wish. But I have two more jobs now. I'm working on a farm, and I'm also working at a shaved ice place. It's like, it's not ice cream. It's shaved ice with, like, flavoring. It's a Robin. But uh yeah I get I get free shaved ice in the summer. It'll be it'll be pretty nice. But uh yeah, I'll be working a lot this summer and I got my college courses, so you know what? I'm getting pretty sidetracked. I'm gonna set everything up real quick. I'll be right back. Okay, so we are back and I got the setup all going right here. So we, we got my lamp on, we got I I thought I turned that lamp on, but I got the spectrum going and actually I probably should have done my research before I like actually buying something. I, I suggest you guys do the same if you're going to invest in something you put into your setup. I would suggest you do your research. But I did not know that this was backlit. But it matches this perfectly. You guys probably can't see how close of a match this is. But it, it's really nice. I love this mouse. And I would highly recommend anybody getting this. So that will be in the description and also what I wanted to point out is look at this. We just hit exactly 900 subscribers when I'm recording this video right now. And we passed 100,000 views quite a while ago so thank you guys very much. And the feedback on this video was amazing so that is exactly why I am making number two. I didn't know how, I didn't know how well this series would go or... How you guys would like it, but you guys are liking it a lot, and you guys have been wanting me to do a giveaway, so I think after I get my entire setup all good that I will start doing a few giveaways, so stay excited for that. That's probably soon to come, but actually, I also set up my speakers, and they are really nice. I They are very small, compact, low profile. You could probably hardly notice it when uh, you're just looking at it as a whole. Yeah, everything looks really organized. I just have to point that out. It looks really nice. I, you know what, you know what, I'm just gonna do a full setup video when this, this series ends. But, yeah, this, that's, that's crazy. But, oh, back to the speakers. These speakers, they're very nice. They're quite light. And you do have to plug them in, but I, I have plenty of outlets everywhere so that's not a problem for me you guys probably need an extension cord when you get a setup like this but yeah just a little sound test you probably you guys probably won't be able to tell just by like listening through this because this camera isn't the best but <laughs> great song by the way but yeah, I think that pretty much wraps it up for the video. And also, the episode 3 probably won't be out for a little while because I'm going to have to start actually 
working pretty hard because the, the next stuff that I need to get for my setup is the more expensive stuff. And I got pretty lucky with the desk right here because the desk right here, as I said in my other video, if you guys watch my other video, uh, I got this from one of my mom's friends for free because they just, they just wanted to get rid of it. So I got lucky with that. That's normally a good chunk of money. I think a decent L desk, like the very cheapest you can get is like $80, which can still take a pretty big toll. And then I think the very next thing I'm going to get is a monitor because I do not like playing on the TV. And then finally, I think we're going to have a whole separate video on a PC because I'm either going to build one or I'm gonna buy one. I don't I don't really know. You guys let me know down in the comment section. But maybe if we start building one, I could make a separate series like that. Just about building a computer from scratch. Maybe you guys would like that. Um, but otherwise, yeah, that's been it for the video, guys. And uh, your feedback was crazy on the other video. I, it'd be great to see that again. So smack a thumbs up if you guys do like this series. And I'll start doing giveaways and stuff like that. But, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and it's been Fez. See ya.